Hello everyone, this is Shalvi Ashwara Verma, Roll No. 48, 7th semester from Tilka Manji Agriculture College, Kodda of Birsa Agricultural University, Rachi. And this is my Rave video presentation. I was attached to the village Kumharia and industry IFCO. Here's a short glimpse of my Rave journey. In this clip, the experienced and senior farmer explaining how they prepare the portray and transplant the small seedlings into the trip irrigation system. Now, drip irrigation system in which in one raised bed, two rows plantation is done. There were many vegetables in the field, broccoli, cauliflower, cabbage, tomato, capsicum, brinjal, pigeon pea and rice were the field crops. Interacting with farmers was another great experience for me. It was fun doing small small activities in their field and the amazing part was that the farmers were so cooperative that they taught me and they allowed me to do the things in their fields. Broccoli was a newly introduced vegetable in their fields. So the vegetables which had high value in markets were favored by farmers. Field preparation is being done. Heap of the cow dung, which is properly mixed in the field. You can see the scenario after the mixing. The field is being leveled step by step. You can see over here the field is leveled and ready for the drip irrigation system formation. After making the ridges at intervals and passing pipelines, it is covered with the polythenes that is the mulching film. A person is making holes in the mulching film so that they can transplant their seedlings in it. You can see in the video these rows are ready and he is preparing the other rows. How perfectly he is making these holes at a proper interval. These are harvested rows with the leftovers after which the film is removed. Just see you can only see the pipelines and later it is left with the leftovers. The farmer's friend Mr. Anu Arao helped me a lot in my Ravi program. These are the seedlings kept in the greenhouse. यहाँ पे कितना है इस गांव में ड्रिप इरिगेशन मतलब ये वाला मशीन कितना लगा ये वाला मशीन होगा लगभग डेढ़ सौ डेढ़ सौ इस पूरे गांव में पूरे गांव में डेढ़ सौ से ज़्यादा होगा और बढ़ते ही जा रहा है अच्छा इसके बाद इसको खाली यहाँ पे थोड़ा सा इसको ब्लॉक कर देंगे ना तो वो अपने खींचते रहे
उसको खोलेंगे जहाँ पे हमको सिंचाई करना है जहाँ खाद डालना है उस महल को वहाँ जाकर खोल लेंगे वहाँ पे जाकर पानी और खाद दोनों चल गया यही यही से टोटल He explained how drip irrigation has evolved the village and the nearby villages because of more cultivation of vegetables. यहाँ से लेके मैंने एकदम last छोर उधर है वहाँ तक जाते हैं थोड़ा पानी यहीं से लगभग पांच एकड़ में सिंचाई होता है तो दो HP का मोटर The motor used was of two HP. इसको तो साफ करने का आसान है इसको साफ करने का है मोटर चल रहा है इसको बाईपास पानी नीचे से भेजे ऊपर से वो अपने जितना इसका कचरा है वो यहाँ से बाहर निकल जाएगा तो यहाँ निकल लेकिन वो वाला स्कैन फिल्टर है उसमें बहुत महीन है तो इसको खोल के इसका जाली से जाली का फिल्टर साफ कर देते हैं खाद कहाँ से डालें हाँ भी यहाँ से डालेगा ड्राम अलग है वो ड्राम का डाल कर दिया जाता है पानी में मिक्स करके इसमें डाल दिया वो ऐसे इसमें ले लिया डाल देंगे वो पानी अपना फिर इसको आधा ब्लॉक कर दिया ऐसे हम्म एक किसी प्रेशर आएगा और एक किसी प्रेशर में दोनों तरफ से पानी लिया खाद वाला भी अलग सा वेल एंड बोरिंग वाज य The females of the house used to help the farmers in small small things. Farmers had little knowledge about the chemicals to be used, but they rely on the farmer's friend for every information. For small problem also, they reached out to him for the solutions. Vermicompost is prepared in this place. There were some greenhouse structures also in the village where farmers used to grow their seedlings for a more relied and less risk cultivation. We can see in the trays that each cell is having just one seedling. This is because in each cell just one seed was sown. Now this is again a drip irrigation system in which one row of plantation is done. Just one row. You can see the harvesting has been done. No doubt that drip irrigation made cultivation so easy and successful. At the same time it looks so beautiful. Now this is at the backyard of one's house. Now we are going to interact with another farmer whose area is this. That's his house. This land area where he does his cultivation. We can see some trees, actually many trees. <laughs> he is also having livestock such as cows, goats in his house. The visit observing plants and onion and garlic cultivation was also seen. Different types of crops observing broccoli closely which could be used in marketing and which not. Cultivation could be so amazing I cannot imagine. Livestock was not much in this village but yeah some. One farmer was having the main occupation about the livestock only. The village is also enhancing in technology. I found solar panels which they used for production of electricity. 
interacting with several farmers introducing them to the ifco's new products such as the nano fertilizers that were nano nitrogen nano zinc and nano copper this session taught me how to talk to people how to present your product how to make them realize that your product is definitely beneficial and important for their crops and their field we demonstrated different products not only the new nano products but also the old products such as agarica npk the bio fertilizers in which farmers were more interested this is the bio fertilizer npk one of the interesting part was making farmer realize and taking them under our confidence that yes they can use it free of tension it is a difficult task to gain their confidence but yes it was fun and interesting as well even in the kisan mela of birsa agricultural university's ground where we had our stall the response of farmers were awesome like each and every farmer was responsive towards our product सम फार्मर्स वे सो इम्प्रेस दैट दे वॉन्टेड टू टेक दी प्रोडक्ट एट सोन एज we give them but these products will come into market after one month of the response of farmers was very nice they wanted to know from where they can get these products This nano nitrogen product is a replacement to the urea. distributing pamphlets and contact numbers to different farmers so that it will be easy for them to reach to our products not only we the students were enjoying this job but also the farmers were showing keen interest in listening to us there were some farmers who had much knowledge about different products but yet they were listening to us as if they know nothing तो ये पूरा जो वीडियो है वो टेल है
Whether counting on the IFCO's experience or the village visit experience, it was amazing for me. I learned a lot. Thank you to each and every one because of whom this program was a success for me. And I'll never forget everything which I learned here and every minute which I spent over here. Now I know why this program is so important in agriculture course as it did play a key factor in my course experience. It is rightly said that all's well that ends well by William Shakespeare and my journey ended with receiving prize. In the end I would like to thank everyone who helped me directly or indirectly in making this program successful. Thank you.